it's addressed to Andrew. This is my turbo kit, not Nick's. Yeah, see? Andrew. Well, that was nice of him to give I you the know, gift. I know, that's a, that's, he's a I know. He's a good man, no matter what they say on YouTube. Like, <laughs> Nick's a good man. It's not July yet, so it's not Christmas in July. Oh. Yeah, it's not. He got keys. There's probably a razor blade like over here. No, nah, it's not. There's usually a razor blade like nope. around. There's usually one right in Eric's hand. Childproof this place because your work flops. It's gonna get a razor blade. You guys have never childproof this place because of my work flops. No, if anything, now we're just I, hoping you get a razor. If blade anything, so. I leave booby traps. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I dropped a rotor on my foot. Uh, that was fine. Oh look, paper. That's just a housing. Oh, it's the oh, anti really? surge. Oh, yeah, really? surge housing. That's nice. I expect them to be larger. So <laughs> that. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at that. Oh. There's so, so much smaller. Could you look at it? Just look at it. Come back, that would just ruin you yep, again. Yep, exactly. <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, fancy and filters. Turbo. And more turbo decals. Ooh, installation DVD. Is this? this is mine. DVD. Is it a Blu-ray? It's probably just the instructions and. Oh, it's a large PDF. <laughs> Thanks, Nick. Oh look, he got black ones. Sweet. There's some hoses. Oh, sweet look. silicone hoses. They included the th the three bar sensor. Bro, we gotta really. Yeah, although he Nick Ooh, a thing. It. Nick, we're gonna have to figure some stuff uh, something out. Nick, sorry, they sent the wrong kit. Everything says SS on it. Man, there's some nice stuff in there. Use box relocation, a gasket. They actually include spark plugs. That's great. Wow, that's hand, hand point link pro charger. <laughs> Wire sat. Oh, I'm curious. This is like pre-made, or yeah. they're just like yeah, that's pre-made. UPP's like, nah, we're just gonna, you know, give you these wire. Oh, that's sweet. Thank you. It saves so much time and cursing. More awesome. This is really well packaged. It's like wow. a Lego set. Oil system. That's that's closer. Push connect hose. This is, wow, that's a gnarly hose. I like that. You need bigger things faster. Is it two drains? It looks like. Yeah, it looks like push two drains. Kit yeah, each one has its own. That's good. It's better than the UPP kit. I'm glad to see uh, T bolt clamps also can hit wing my pro charger. Yeah. <laughs> that's cool. I'm glad they supply all this stuff. I despise these things, but. <laughs> Get a nice little rotor brush in here. Rotor bit. More stuff. So much more stuff. So, where's the rest of the turbo? So, where's the intercooler and like the rest of it? I'm glad they label every single thing. Passenger side intercooler two with blow off valve. It's not a bead roll, it's just a, a bead bubble. Hey, if it works, it works. It's got three of them, so. I'm actually surprised this is uh, steel. Steel? Yeah. Not aluminum, but why? Cheaper, probably? Maybe. Downpipe clearanced. It's got a big old dent in it. <laughs> That's what they mean by clearance. Hey, at least it's done beforehand. Yeah, you don't have to do it afterhand. Afterhand. Okay. It, uh, two blow -offs. I don't want to make it not pretty. Mm. <sighs> I was hoping I'd see decent wastegate priority for once, but I guess not. Nope. This is <laughs> weird looking. <laughs> Where's the other side? Go dog, I heard you were an exhaust fan. Is that the other side? No, that's the downpipe. I already opened one of those. Is this? Did you use a factory one? It might. I'm sorry. Okay. Now it's right here. 
It's here. I was gonna say I wouldn't have the pump. Same one. Huh? It would have made sense to only have one. It's nice looking stuff. Like everything is labeled. I'm gonna take it out of the packaging so it's no longer labeled. Well I know what this is. But I'm used to nothing labeled. Just here's a box of parts, figured out. This is cool. I'm starting to want this more and more. <laughs> I'm like, when are you buy one now? Cause... Yeah. Yeah, I was already talking to them about it. I'm like, I'm gonna see how this works on Nick's car first before I like jump the gun on mine. What the fuck was that? A Velociraptor? Did you hear that? <laughs> That no, was Alex's mating call. <laughs> <laughs> cool, man. Well, that one's more of a 90 or a 45. Yeah, I mean, it's better because it's on a bend. That's the passenger that's, side. That's definitely better, yeah. It's the craziest looking setup ever. They uh, just finished their single turbo, the C7. Really? Yep. UPP that kit for sale? For a very long time. Yeah. He started talking to me about like getting it over for me. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm already down that path. I'm, I'm done. Keep on holding it. Hold it tight. I think you're taking a picture. <laughs> no. No, uh, no, just a, a, video. Just a video of Andrew being retarded. It's, it's not like my old football days. All right, I'm done. <laughs> We painted the turbo housings. They look like they came out pretty nice. And uh, we're just waiting on the center section now. We got the intercooler. This is nice. This is actually, it's pretty heavy. It's like 25 pounds, but it's, uh, it's nicer than the intercooler that was on my Corvette. I had a very similar design. Uh, not as, not as big though. And, uh, yeah, we're going to see how this works out. The mass airflow ends up going right in the end tank of the intercooler. So hopefully that, that works out well for us. It's here. It's here. Oh boy, look, 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 look who's here. We got a delivery! I think we've got a, an engine for the Freedom Rocket's sister. Oh boy. If we could just throw it right behind this truck here, that'd be great. I really appreciate it. Perfect. It's Armageddon. So here is Nick's old engine. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a couple pieces that we're gonna use on the new engine off of it, uh, such as the rocker arms, the, uh, the front cover, the balancer, stuff like that. We're gonna transfer it over to this guy. This thing, this thing is beautiful. These are, this is a Texas Speed 416 cubic inch, cubic inch block. It is a sleeve block, which is wild. It's got the Texas Speed uh, uh, ported heads on it. Like they're uh, PRC heads. The, it's got the uh, ARP head studs. Uh, the uh, Texas Speed or maybe PRC springs that are made by Pac now. I mean, it's like all good stuff, really good stuff. And I gotta tell you, I'm really, really impressed how well they've taken care of our customer here because they sent it with an oil pump and timing chain gear all set up, ready to go. Everything, like, this guy's kind of expensive and they sent it with it, all, all timed, ready to go. The uh, I'm sure the cam phaser's already in here. We got the lifters already in, uh, the custom cam already in. It's, uh, it's a nice piece. All I gotta do is hook up a pickup tube windage tray which they also sent the windage tray like spacers which are actual spacers rather than just like 
using the, you know, stacking washers. There's there's spacers for this four inch stroke. It is, uh, it is wild. It is a nice kit. You can see that we have the DOD block off plugs, which are right here. We have these guys. What they do is, uh, when these cars are built, they have the displacement on demand lifters, and this will bleed off the oil pressure so they can collapse and it can shut down to four cylinders. Now, the ZL1 doesn't use it even though it has the equipment. It's kind of wild, but uh, this, uh, this is this is definitely needed when you do the uh, the factory like LS7 or the CTSB racing lifters or whatever other lifter you're putting in. A lot of people do uh, this because one, it's cheap and completely effective. And other people go with the, uh, the K-Tech uh, valley cover. It's a bit more expensive. Uh, it does the same thing. The only thing with the K-Tech valley cover is it uh, you have to transfer the baffle over, otherwise you get like oil like sucked into the intake and all sorts of stupid shit. Well, yeah. So, next step, getting all that stuff that we need on the here and dropping it in what used to be a Camaro over yonder.